my skincare routine like I like everything else. Simple and I like to take a less but better approach. So using high quality products and using the right ingredients but not getting caught up in fads and trends. I like to use things that actually work. Personally, I love a cleansing oil. This one is my favorite and I've been using it for years now. I love the way an oil feels on my face and I love that it doubles up as a makeup remover as well. This one is a really beautiful natural oil that is locally made too. I like to use a very hot flannel on my face. I love the way that this feels and it saves me from having to splash water on my face. Next, I like to use this Pixi Glow Tonic. It's a really great exfoliant and I find it gives a really nice glow as well. And I apply this with a cotton pad. I always use a vitamin C serum. The one that I've been using lately is this Medicaid one and I've been loving it. I like to apply it straight to my skin using the pipette. And again, I found it to give a really nice glow. The last thing I always finish with in the morning is an SPF. This Clarins one I sort of inherited because it was given to me, but I've been finding it really lovely. I like the way that it, it sits on my skin and I find that makeup goes on top of it really well too. My nighttime skincare routine is similar in that it's very simple. I always go in with the oil cleanser first. Again, I love how it doubles up as a makeup remover so I can use this on my eyes and give my face a really nice massage to get everything off. And then I follow with a fresh flannel that's been drenched in hot water. In the evening, I always cleanse my face twice. I do this to make sure that makeup is removed properly and even if I haven't worn makeup, I'll still do this to get the SPF off my face properly. The next step is a retinol. And again, Medicaid is my go-to brand for this. I've been using this retinol for years now and it's really good for anti-aging. This is a new addition. I do like to have a facial oil to hand, especially in the winter when my skin can feel quite dry. This one was very kindly gifted to me and I have been really enjoying it. I don't always wear both. Most of the time I will alternate, but depending on what my skin needs, sometimes I'll go all in. And 
And lastly, I always finish with a lash serum. This one I've been finding good, though I have to say I do prefer the Grande Lash that I was using before. I find that my eyelashes were better using that, but this one is fine until I finished it. And that's it.